Hey everyone, it's uh, Tuesday. Uh, we have uh, three sales lined up here um, for this evening, uh, and then maybe one more later. We got the rocking chair. I lowered some prices just to get rid of some stuff. We got the rocking chair going out for five. Uh, I got this activity table going out for five dollars, and we have the height chair going out for fifteen. So that's a total of uh, twenty-five dollars. And uh, later we have a toaster oven for twenty. So hopefully we'll get about forty-five dollars today, but we'll see how that goes. All right, everything sold except for the rocking chair. Um, it wasn't wide enough for the guy that sat in it, so he did not take it. So I got $20 on that run. Uh, the rocking chair, I have a couple other backup buyers I'm messaging, so we'll hopefully get that out maybe tomorrow. Uh, and I have the toaster oven going out here in just a short bit. So that's where we're at, and uh, we'll be doing some trash picking a little bit later tonight. All right, we're making our other delivery of the toaster oven. Uh, that's gonna be for $20. Um, so. I think that'll be our last delivery for the day, and then we'll head out trash picking. All right, so that wraps up our sales for tonight. Uh, we have a total of $40 sales. The one uh, rocking chair got canceled, and so it was gonna be 45, but we got 40, that's good enough for tonight. Uh, we'll probably get that rocking chair out tomorrow night, hopefully. Uh, I have a couple other interested people. So yeah, so let's get out there, um, start trash picking, and uh, see what we can find. Gotta check out and see what this is over here. Ah, oh, it's got a big tear in it. All right, I got a lot of stuff here. I don't know, I don't see really seeing a whole lot, but I have one of those, I can't even sell it. Sometimes remotes are good to have. I don't think I want to take it. I think there's nothing really here that I really need. Yeah, I don't see anything that's worthwhile getting. There's a couple things. Let's see what this is. No roof on the t no top on the top of that. I don't think I need either one of those either. I'm missing the top. Just checking out what this is. Uh, huh. I'm not sure what that is. What's new? Little mini mouse. I think that it smells really bad. Alright guys, I am back from trash picking and I'll tell you what, it's been a while since this happened but we got nothing. I came back with an empty truck. 
I did not find anything really that was worth keeping. Uh, you'll see in the video everything that I looked at. Um, maybe there was some stuff I could have got, um, but I just decided that with my garage the way it is right now being so full, I just didn't have any room for um, anything that, that I saw that didn't just didn't look like it was be anything to make any real money with. So, um, so I will show you though some of the stuff from yesterday. Um, let me go over here and show you. I got some stuff laying on top of it, but all right. So this is the um, just the false craft stuff that was in the uh, one um, box. So I think there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So there's ten uh, coffee mugs um, or tea mugs or whatever you want to call them. And then this is tall, a taller one here. There's one of those. So I think those are those are on eBay. So those are something we can sell. I think it's called the Tea Rose Collection. Um, so we'll get some money out of those. Um, then let me move some of this. There's some toys. We have stuff everywhere. Then we had some, um, just a bunch of miscellaneous stuff in here. So this is just basically uh, some plates, some bowls, um, some miscellaneous uh, glasses, and a, a lid that didn't fit anything. Uh, so those are, um, I'll just probably lot that all together and sell that to somebody uh, if they want it as one lot, you know, for five or ten dollars. Uh, and then the pans that I got, there was two pans. I just threw them in, uh, in with my other pans that I have, and I'll just include those with the, with the lot as like a bonus to whoever buys the pan lot that I already had together. Um, and then, let me see where I have. Uh, right here is um, false craft. Um, and this is for like your sugar and stuff. And these are all kind of dirty, but most of them are chipped. Like you can see, this is chipped right there. Um, it's chipped right here. The lid is chipped on that one. So I don't know what I'm going to do with those. I'm assuming um, that I'll probably just maybe throw them away or donate them. Um, I'll, I'm going to ask my wife what she thinks. But yeah, so I don't know what to do with them. So maybe somebody wants like one of the lids or something. I can maybe list it. Maybe someone will buy one for a lid or something that they broke theirs. I, but it's uh, it'll probably sit on on eBay for a while probably. So I don't know if I want to do that. Um, and then I have one box down below. Let me move this and I'll show you what's in there. All right. So this box is mostly mugs. Uh, some of them were handmade by the kid by the kids. I guess I don't know why they were out the curb. Um, I don't know if they moved or something and left them there. And then there's some other mugs in there, and I'll check them for any value, but I didn't see anything that looked like it was worth much. Um, but I'll, I'll go through them and, and uh, see what the, those mugs are worth in, on eBay or something and go from there. Um, and then um, I did get that pencil table that was pretty nice. Uh, the One of the legs was wobbly. I took that off last night and glued it. So it's dry now. I can... Uh, Put that back um, it was a split piece of wood like right here um, right there the wood split but now it'll be nice and sturdy because I really did a good job gluing it up and I'll um, go ahead and I'll put that back one to the table and that'll be ready to sell um, the Santa Claus uh, I, there was a date on the bottom I think 1991 so that's uh, so I can do some research on that and see um, the, the, this uh, radio, um, this one right here, does work as well as the one over here um, that had the detachable speakers, it works as well. So I'll list all that stuff. Um, and so the other, the other thing um, that I got going on is um, obviously this is getting out of control with, this, with my space here. Um, and I, I'm going to explore the option of maybe getting a storage unit um, that is close to right next door to where I meet people um, from Facebook Marketplace. So my, my idea is it's like a trash pick. I could take everything to the storage unit um, and take pictures there and list it and leave it sit in the storage unit. And then if somebody says, hey, I want this, I can just run down to the storage unit, which is right next to where I meet people. And I can just... Uh, 
grab it out of the storage unit and drive drive it over to the place where I meet them and then sell it. So and then that'll free up my garage um, from all these large items. So I'm thinking though I'll still use my garage for like eBay and Macari, and I'll, uh, you know I'm, I don't want to move everything to the storage unit. I don't think. I think I'll keep the large items only in the storage unit. Um, I was looking at different sizes. I think there's like a 14 by 24, um, which is a pretty decent size storage unit, one of the larger ones, um, for under $200 a month. So um, probably like 180. Uh, I'm waiting for a quote from another place. Uh, 180 was down the street a little farther for uh, 300, 10 by 10 by 30, I believe. Um, this one that I'm looking at, which is right next door to where I meet people, um, that one is, they didn't have a 10 by 30, they had a 14 by 24. Um, so that's uh, still good, still a good size. It's square footage wide, it's, I think it's more. Um, ten to four, yeah, no, no, do the math. Um, so, um, yeah, so that that is exciting. I'm excited to, to be exploring that option. Um, it would be awesome to clean, get this under control, have some extra space, get things cleaned up. It would give me more room to work and get things listed in a, in a more. I, right now, I'm just walking over top of myself. Too much stuff everywhere. Um, every time I sell something, I'm like, oh yes, I got like a little bit of space back. Um, so it'd be nice to have some space and be able to set some things up and just take pictures and and stuff like that. So um, like, I have some beds over here that I got right, right there. I have not gotten those. I want to set. I want to set those up and take pictures. But there's nowhere for me to set them up. I, I have to set them up in the driveway, and I can only do that during the day because otherwise I can't take pictures. So if I had some space, um, I could do that, set them up, get pictures, get them listed, sell them. So just I just need to, to get things uh, much more organized. Um, right now it's chaos in here. So um, yeah, so that's my good plan. Is the I'm going to keep doing what we're doing. We're going to keep keep trash picking. I know we got shut out tonight, but we'll keep trash picking. We'll keep picking things up. I noticed today that storage units are starting to come back. Um, there was quite a few in my area that ended today. I looked at a few. I didn't see any that really struck me as like I wanted. I wanted to go out and bid. Um, there was most of them were kind of not good stuff. Um, but there is a lot more storage units coming back, so maybe that is uh, starting to pick up now. Um, also, some of them didn't didn't get bid up as much as they were. So. Hopefully the price stays down a little bit um, on the storage uh, storage units uh, auctions. Hopefully that price stays down a little bit and we can start uh, winning some of those. If I have my own storage unit, like a like a 10 by 30 or something in that area, I can use that to to take storage unit stuff and and go through it. Um, don't have to tie up my garage. So it's um, got really some great ideas. So that's my plan. Uh, so. Um, we'll be back tomorrow. Um, we did get forty dollars of sales today, so that's good too. So we'll be back tomorrow with uh, maybe some sales and hopefully some uh, trash picking videos at the end of the day. So uh, thanks, and make sure you hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. Uh, like the video, leave any comments. I'll definitely answer. Uh, thanks for watching.